Pisces, you guys, this is your reading. If it does not resonate, check your moon, rising Venus, and Jupiter. Listen, oh, we got the eight of wands. You guys, shut your mouth. <laughs> shut it, shutty, shutty. Okay, so I just heard you gotta be a little greedy. Sweetie, with the four pentacles in the position of how you're being seen, you need to be greedy. I'm hearing it with the eight of wands and the king of pentacles in the reverse. He kind of greedy. He kind of greedy, egotistical, wants things his way. He's the pentacle man. He's the, he's the business owner, CEO. Some of you could be done with a Capricorn or Taurus energy. Okay. Someone who has a Leo in their chart. They're Leo. Some of them are Leo. Oh, snaps. Oh my God. Okay. Okay. I see where we're going with this. <laughs> this motherfucker wants to remove obstacles. They want to remove anything that's in their way. This person, okay, I'm, eh, King of Pentacles in reverse, not such a bad thing, but it is a my way or a highway energy. You know, all the kings in reverse um, can be sort of a low vibrational energy, but I don't see this as a bad or negative with all the surrounding cards here. Oh, wait, okay, <laughs> spoke too soon. We have the King of Cups in reverse. Okay, wow. Okay, well, somebody is an alcoholic. Yeah, they're showing me an alcoholic here with the Five of Pentacles and the King of Cups in reverse. This is someone you left out in the cold, Pisces. Oh, baby. Okay, so they're saying you need to be greedy. You need to be stingy with your time, your energy, your money. Um, there's something about a divorce here. Okay, I heard a divorce. But if it's not a divorce, this is a severing. I'm hearing a severing. You got to, oh, oh my God, look. You got the seven of cups. I'm sorry. The, yeah, seven of cups mirroring the ten of pentacles. Okay, you guys, if you're new, stick around. I got some free personal readings coming your way. You're going to get two free personal readings. And I'll let you have, know how to do that in a second. Just give me a minute, okay? I'm going to go over these cards really quick. Um Yeah, this person was manipulative. <sighs> Eight of Wands. Yeah, okay. <sighs> this person's coming back. They're showing me this This is a, a Pisces. It could be you, Pisces. A Sag, a, a Libra, a Taurus, a Gemini, Virgo, Aries, Leo. They're coming back, okay? I don't know why they're... I'm hearing they're coming back. Eight of Wands. They're, they're going to come towards you, Pisces. This person's drinking a lot. Like on the plane. I see, girl, I see this person drinking on the plane. This person was drinking in the ride over to the plane, over to the airport. This person drinking on the plane. They're drinking when they get off the plane. This motherfucker drinking... <laughs> Jesus Christ. Holy shit. Who the hell's story is this? This could be yours, Pisces. Somebody drinks a lot, okay? I see wine, though. It's not like they're... This is a classy drunk. <laughs> I don't know if there's any such thing as classy drunk, but this is a... They're saying a classy drunk. They're, they got they got a sense of humor. I don't know. Um, <laughs> at least I'm a classy drunk, okay? This person drinks on the plane, off the plane. This person drinks all day long. Waiting for the plane. They were waiting for the plane. They were fucking drinking in the bar. Oh, my God. Okay. So, um... This person's coming to you. I feel with this energy and also all that. They keep showing me a plane, you guys. This person flies a uh, business class. Okay, yeah. This person is fine as fuck. They are in really good shape. I ain't gonna lie. This person is in really good shape. But I feel like this person would be drinking like heavily just so they could talk to you, Pisces. Because they can't, they can't, they don't know how to talk to you. <laughs> oh, shit. With the magician in the reverse and the seven of wands in reverse, this person doesn't know how to talk to you unless they're drunk. 
Yeah, I, I don't know why. Pisces, this could be about messages from this person too. Like I am getting someone who could have, like Eight of Wands is something coming in very fast. It's forward movement. It's action. Okay. King of Cups is very emotional, right? It's in the, it's mirroring that, that eight of wands. It's in the reverse. Like they keep showing me someone on a plane that's drinking with these two cards. I don't know why. Anyways, they keep drinking and they're like thinking about you. Even when they're texting you, like when they get off the plane before you guys, you guys, let me tell you something. He, this person probably wouldn't have been talked to you if they didn't drink. So for some of you, if this person reached out to you and your first message from them was a little weird or awkward or they like, I don't know, for some of you who knew this person from the past, they're showing me also, those of you with the Five of Pentacles and someone you left out in the cold, they're showing me somebody here who, who never talked to you and they've been in love with you, okay? Because how they feel about you is the Ten of Pentacles and the Seven of Cups. Like this person's worried um, with the Four of Pentacles. Like they, 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 they worried because they want to give you this, this Ten of Pentacles. You see, that's how they feel about you. So they're just, they could be traveling from far, you know, far away to give this to you. I am seeing a ring, you guys. But this is like options, you guys. Options, okay? Um, Seven of Cups is like someone, I think that this person is in their low vibration because they're worried. They're, they're, their mind is spiraling. They're showing me somebody, a Gemini, a Virgo. They're showing me somebody who has a lot of mercurial activity going on within themselves, okay? A lot of energy within their thoughts. Their crown chakra is going off. This person could have a past life with you. This person has a, have, has a lot of anxiety around this connection because they don't know how to express themselves. And this is why they drink. They're drinking because it helps them loosen up and helps them relax. Um, this person, <laughs> they find you to be intimidating is what I heard with the seven of wands and five of wands, eight of wands, okay? <clears throat> this person finds you very intimidating. Very intimidating. Um, some of you guys with the justice in reverse, how you're being seen, somebody thinks it's not fair. I don't know what this, what this is alluding to. This could be about your options with them mirroring, okay? They're not they're not letting something go, is what I'm hearing. Um about your connection with someone else. All right. Oh, uh, Pisces, you're there's you have a jealous energy here. I am gonna say this because I don't I don't see the energy of jealousy in the cards, but I feel the energy of jealousy. This man is this is a it's a man, you guys. It's a man, okay? Sorry, fellas. Those, it could be opposite. It could be a masculine energy, a female with fire sign. Um, they're saying Aries, Leo, Sag, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, female, okay? Um, but those of you, those of you, if it's a man, I'm getting an Earth sign or a um, uh, a Leo. I'm hearing it's a Leo or a Gemini. Sag, they're showing me Sagittarius, okay? Um, they're showing me uh, Aries, okay? But they're showing me Taurus and Pisces as well. This energy is, is a bit unbalanced because this person actually really adores you, Pisces. And I think that they're mad about something. I think, too, because you pushed them to the side. There's something here about that with the Five of Pentacles and the Five of Wands mirroring. By the way... Yeah, there two, there's two fives mirroring in your reading. You definitely could be dealing with fifth house, okay? Leo, or you have a fifth house. Energy strongly aspected throughout your chart. So the energy here is your reading. Like this is your reading, they're saying. Whoever has fives, or they see fives a lot, or five, the number five is your life path number, or uh, this, they're saying this is your reading about someone who's coming towards you, flying to you, that's drinking a lot, okay? Um, anyways, back to what I was saying about the options. They don't... They're upset about this option that you have. I don't know if you are, were with this person, okay? They're not telling me if you were with this person, but they're trying, this person is manipulating the situation to kind of go in their favor here with the Justice card in reverse and the Magician in reverse. It feels like um, they're wanting you to let your guard down with the Seven of Wands, okay? They're wanting you to really let them in, okay? Um, and give them a chance. I think that they know that maybe drinking is a problem, like you don't like it. Maybe some of you don't like it. You've mentioned it to them, but they don't know how to talk to you without drinking why did i just see raj i just saw raj from the big bang theory like oh my god it's totally that kind of situation like where he cannot even talk to women it's not that they can't talk to women it's like they can't talk to you though it's like you're very intimidating maybe you just really have your shit together or you guys are just really beautiful like goddamn or something really there's just like seven of cups is like someone who has it all okay this does create confusion though for some of you these are options these are um 
These are emotions, others of you, with the water energy here. The cups represent our emotions, also intuition. These are about gifts that you have, okay, for some of you, especially with the Ten of Pentacles mirroring it. This person is very intimidated, and I don't, I get it. I totally understand. We have the Five of Wands in the obstacle position. Five of Wands is about con competition, right? And then we have the Five of Pentacles. It's like someone who feels left out in the cold. It's in the obstacle position. So this is, this person is very conflicted, okay? They know that there's a lot of people watching you or competing for your energy or your love or something here there's a lot of people competing for your love your money your your time i get that, like because the seven of cups represents a lot of things in different scenarios as well okay so this is like for some of you this person like i don't know like maybe you're a business owner because you know this this king of pentacles is someone who owns a business can even own multiple businesses you could have like i'm getting you are the ceo okay and somebody maybe maybe this is someone who works for you and they feel intimidated or this might even not even be romantic interest but they're telling me this person's in love with you okay um they're showing me this with the king of cups mirroring the eight of wands they're showing me someone who's in love with you pisces the energy that's coming towards you this person's very passionate about you this is someone who wins okay this this is someone who wins okay they're a winner they're not a loser um they're not like sleeping on the couch all day and doing nothing. <laughs> um, they could travel a lot is also what they're showing me. But yeah, like this, this motherfucker is on the plane. I'm even hearing like they talk a lot when they drink. Okay. Some of you, you might notice like when they're not, when they're not drinking, they're real quiet. But when they drink, they're really open so i don't know like this if this resonates for you or not but um, i'm gonna pull from my new deck here i got a it's mindful messages i just want to get one for you guys and these are just random messages that you may need to hear at this time they're not really going to correlate to the reading but um maybe it will who knows okay let's jump in and let's see i like this deck oh it's so nice and cute i got this on amazon you guys i don't really know who it's by hold on yeah, it doesn't really tell me who, yeah, it doesn't have it on the box, which is weird. Um, anyways, I'll have to go look. These are really cute. They got that astrology vibe to them. Anyways, um, Pisces, let's see what we got for you. We have morning rituals. In the mornings, I will take time to tune into myself to set high vibrational rituals that will help me lead a good day. I pay attention to the morning habits that don't serve me and change them for ones that do. Wow. So I'm getting some spring cleaning with this, like cleaning out my closet, cleaning out my bed, <laughs> cleaning out my bed. <laughs> Cleaning out your closet, cleaning out your bed. How do you go from closet to bed? Like, first of all, who you got in your bed, okay? <laughs> I see somebody here spiritually cleansing, though. Like, this is like, too, they're saying take baths, be, go swimming, a lot of swimming, okay, for you, Pisces. They're showing me someone who needs to get in water. So water is a very... Um, important aspect right now for you. Also, I, I, I'm getting you need to wear some sort of amulet for some of you, some protection. Um, not all of you, just a few of you guys here, okay? Just because I see this energy, um, the seven of wands. I think you need to wear something here about, yeah, it's showing me with the seven of wands, five of wands energy. Someone needs to, to wear like, um, ooh, okay, yeah. Like, uh, what is it? I can't even tell what that is. Sodalite? I think that's like Geminian energy. They're showing me blue, the color blue. So um, something for the throat chakra here. Pisces, if it's not, if it's the other person, they're also showing me. Um, if it's you, Pisces, you need to wear like um, the third eye chakra. Not third eye, um, throat chakra crystal. Okay, I think it's called Sodalite. Sodalite? Sodalite? I don't even know. It kind of looks like this. I think this is the throat chakra yeah so yeah you need to put this like in your bra or like i don't know what, like put it on your neck or something i'm hearing you need to wear it on around your neck they're showing me around the neck like a choker they're showing me a choker okay you guys know what i'm talking about the chokers females you guys know what i'm talking about all right guys i love you so much Take advantage of free personal readings. They're down below. Tons of them down there, okay? There's a lot of free goodies there. There's spells. 
uh, all kinds of shit. You guys need to check that stuff out, man. Okay, and we got the first. The first two links are my uh, free personal readings, my gift to you. All you do is enter your birthday at those websites. Okay, I love you guys so much. You're gonna get a free um, video report all about you. All right, you guys have a wonderful week. Namaste.